Hi fellas, um, afternoon. Today's makeup tip is all about eyebrows. Um, I get a lot of people saying to me, you know, I wish I could have a different shaped eyebrow for different occasions. Um, obviously sometimes you want a thinner eyebrow for the more 1950s look and other times you just want it a bit thicker because obviously that's quite modern and in at the moment. Um, well, one way of doing it is to shave your eyebrows off completely um, and then just pencil in with, um, with an eyeliner um, or an eyebrow pencil, pencil in the eyebrow you want. But a lot of people don't like doing this because obviously it's quite permanent shaving your eyebrows off completely. Um, so I, I thought I'd share with you um, a trick that the makeup artists like to keep under their belt, but I'm gonna share it with you today. It's really easy. All you need to do is get some sticky labels and um, I purchased these as you can see from Ryman, but you can get them from any stationers, Smiths or Ryman's, or probably a lot of supermarkets do them too. Um, I think this only cost about £2.39 um, for a pack of about ooh, 150 so they last you a while. Um, get a, a, a black felt tip I find works best here, um, and just, just draw on the onto the actual labels themselves. I'm going to do this very, very quickly, um, just so you get a feeling of what I mean. Um, just draw the eyebrows that you want um, and colour them in just so that they're a nice a nice dark colour or I mean yeah d just choose the shape that you want sorry about this um, I should have done these earlier but um, yeah uh, they don't have to be expensive labels any kind of label will do um, but there we have, as you can see, I've uh, drawn a couple of eyebrows on onto them there. And all you need to do is just unpeel it, unpeel one of them. Um, and this one is the, oh yeah, that's the right side. Obviously, see, as you can see here, that bit is thicker towards the, the brim of your nose. So just make sure that's equal on your label. And just, these are going to be slightly too high, I think, but there we go. Uh, and just pop it, stick it onto the eye like that. Um, and again, the other side. Um, if you have more time, you might want to cut that bit there. I'll, I'll do it to this label. I'll just fold it over because it, it, it will give your eye more room to blink. Um, I, I just had to do that one quite quickly. So, but I'll, no, we'll just bend that up there. And then you can, oh dear, my eyelashes are stuck. You see, this is why I should have prepared these earlier. Sorry, folks. But, um, been very very busy today and there we have um, a couple of eyebrows there um, as you can see I'm looking a little bit quizzical um, but that's just because I did it in a hurry uh, so obviously take time on them uh, and it will have a better effect the good thing about um, these labels is that you can pre-prepare them obviously um, there's a lot of a lot of information in the press about the more you move your face, the more wrinkles your your face will get when it's older. Um, so the less you move your face, the better. So if you, if you want to avoid wrinkles in the future, I'm just going to take that off there because it's all getting in the way of my eyelashes. Um, just be very careful when you peel them off, so you don't actually peel off your real eyebrows. Yes. Yeah, so. Um, if you're having a conversation with someone, these do come in rather handy. So, for example, let's say somebody tells you a joke um, and you find it funny, you want to show them that you find it funny but you don't want to get wrinkles in your face by moving your face. Have some pre-prepared ones ready. So these are my laughter eyebrows. Don't forget to fold underneath so it doesn't get in the way of your eyelashes there. Um, and as you can see, there we go, and again on the other side, Laughter eyebrows should be slightly raised because when you laugh, your eyebrows get higher. And then if I mix that with a, <laughs> a laugh, um, then the other person will, will be able to tell that I find their joke funny. Um, another example is if, if they say something that makes you angry, um, and don't worry about taking these off. The mar marvelous thing about this is that you can uh, put them on uh, one after the other. Um, and this is an angry eyebrow. Uh, it's that way around, I think. Or is it that? No, it's that. Oh, it's that way. Yeah. Okay, so just pop it over that one like that. And sorry. Oh, there we go. I just dropped those there. Um, and again, on the other side, angry eyebrow. There. And as you can see, I look very angry. And that just conveys to the other person without 
making my face get wrinkles conveys anger that they've made me very angry. Um, of course, another fantastic thing about these labels is that you can um, you can accessorise them to whatever colour you like. Um, and I always think it's a shame that we go around with the same colour eyebrows. As you can see, I'm wearing a lovely pink necklace, so I've done some pink eyebrows to go with it. And that would be really, really nice when you're going out with your girlfriends for an evening for some wine, um, or if you're at the theatre and you want to look a little bit more glamorous. I'm just going to finish that off with some pink on my lips, like that. There we go. Ah, ah. There we go. There we go. Ah, ah, ah. There we go. And as you can see, it's all matching. Um, and the the lasting result is, is as you can see, quite pleasing. So that's it from me uh, for this afternoon. I will be back with more makeup tips that the makeup artists like to keep secret. Um, but as always, not all at once. Bye bye.